짜잔! 굿 모닝 에브리원 이츠 리사 웰컴 백투 마이 채널 잇 이즈 웨이 인 웬스데이 디스 웬스데이 I was about to say March May 4th so you guys know from last week's Way in Wednesday that I was struggling a little bit with how to sort of kickstart I guess the plan to see if I could lose weight or if maybe I should change my goal still pondering the goal part but There were a couple of things I did differently this week, but first I'll get to my weigh-in. Last week I weighed 120.8. This week I weighed 118.6 for a total loss of 2.2 pounds over the last week and a grand total loss of 11.9, almost 12 pounds since I started. Um, that puts me 3.6 away from my, I have a dream goal of 115. Um, I stood on the scale this morning and I did after that what any rational person would do and I moved the scale to a dozen different places in the bathroom and stepped on it again thinking surely that can't be right 118.6 118.6 I look like <laughs> if anybody was GPS tracking me I'd look like dit, 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 all over the freaking bathroom um, so one of the things I did this week was think really hard about whether or not I was going to eat all my weeklies And instead of thinking about it as far as, yes, I'm going to eat all my weeklies, no, I'm not going to eat all my weeklies, I just decided that instead of consciously thinking I was going to eat all my weeklies, I would only eat my weeklies if I really needed to. And I, I don't know if that makes a whole lot of sense, but here's where it started. I made a conscious effort of all the things I did over the last week to not snack as much. I decided that I was kind of filling in some holes with snacks and that was bumping out my day into you know the 30 plus range and into my weeklies and then I was using the rest of my weeklies on the weekends for a special occasion kind of thing so I decided I was just going to really try hard to not eat so much between meals um, it worked on some days some days I had more snacks than others though But the underlying revelation that came to me in the last couple of days is that there were times when I was truly, I shouldn't say it quite that way, there were times that I was hungry. And I don't mean I'm really hungry and I need to eat. It was more like I'm sitting there thinking, my stomach's kind of growly. And I would drink some water and most of the times it would go away if it didn't or got worse then I would go and have something to eat and it dawned on me that during a run in like January early February when I had lost a lot I was having hunger pains and I shouldn't say I lost a lot I was losing more consistently I was having hunger pangs and it wasn't an awful thing it wasn't every single day every single meal oh my goodness I'm so hungry I could chew my arm off it was just more like every once in a while My stomach's kind of growly and you know 90% of the time water would take care of it and I, I that kind of little light bulb in my head this week made me realize that for, for me personally in a weight loss mode there are times I need to be a little bit hungry I don't need to be starving but I also don't need to be sated 100% of the time and I, I realize now, and I'm hopefully by video logging this, I can remember that in a maintenance mode, I can eat 30 points a day and you know, 21, 28, 30 weeklies and feel sated and not lose weight. But in order for me to lose weight, I'm gonna have to have those times where I think, I think I might be hungry and kind of go from there and be okay with it. Um, it's not, I don't want anybody to get any wrong ideas. I'm not starving myself. It's not an uncomfortable sensation. I'm not about to pass out from low blood sugar. It's just, you know, sort of a gnawing like, hmm, I'm a little bit empty here. So um, it, was, it was an interesting revelation for me. So for the moment, given that, I'm going to try to approach the next couple of weeks that way. Not eat 
all of my weeklies or make a plan to eat all of my weeklies, but to use them when I need to, to pay attention to my hunger cues more and to try not to snack so much during the week um, or during the day. So that's what I have for this week's Away in Wednesday. Thanks so much for watching. I appreciate each and every one of you. If you like what you see, be sure to subscribe to my channel so you get updates on when I post new videos. And I will talk to you soon.